All right. Hello, everybody. Woo. Hello, Dwarves, Clutter Thoughts, Vane Strange, Nekov, King Ragnarok, and Kajoka. I think I got everybody. Welcome back to Olympus Company! Woo! A rare, uh, non new, uh, it's odd that we don't have uh, an ultimate, um, Ishmael, uh, identity for the, th for the final update for Chapter 5, eh? I guess we'll get it next week. Hopefully I'll get it. That'd be cool if we can get it in time for, um, the, uh, when I get to the dungeon. Because <laughs> I am most certainly not getting to that dungeon until next week. But, uh, yeah. Uh, we finally, uh, the, uh, the chapter's been fully updated, so, uh, we're probably, ha even though we're probably halfway through, and we got a bunch of stuff. I, uh, because I did the dungeon, I've, I got my, uh, pass up to 90, which would normally be more than enough to fill it, but... Uh, it's up to 120 now to get the Ishmael Wa ID, unfortunately. The battle Pass Ego aren't very good. Yeah, it, it gets rid of Rogia's best ego. The fucking, the Ice Ego, which is her best ego. Like, seriously, Rogia did not need a separate Teth. <laughs> I, 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 I haven't heard about, um... Ryoshi, so. Alright. Let's get back into it. The Lake and the Butterfly 2. Story slash fight. She's got uh, her new ego. I may as well put that on, uh, but yeah. Oh yeah, Sinclair's new ego, I think I put on him. My oh, I, oh, I don't think I, oh, oh yeah, that's right. I don't think I, um, I didn't, uh, I didn't upgrade it. There we go. Now he has another he. Awesome. He went from having no he ego to having two. <laughs> All right. So uh, yeah, I think this is a this is a pretty good mix. Let's get. Kullo chongwa go, gekutan segeru seura. Oh, all the LCCB. They're all fucked. Pallet by petals began to fill the void rim left behind. It's gonna be deduced that it was his influence that kept the mermaids at bay. But why? I can only theorize that their primal sense of certain ebbs and flows of energy remained even as their reason eroded. I read that, Kajoka. So yeah, what they did was they, they did like a temporary nerf until they were able to implement changing your teams. It must be a pretty hard boss. You're saying that he scared them off or something? Sinclair, on his forehead there was... <laughs> yeah. The one who bisected Cromer with a flick of his wrist. The one who silently approached me to talk. Damien, yeah, or Domain. I remember the one marked with the bright red sign. 
And uh, Sinclair has that sign too, I think. Wow, that was a very short first section, I just realized. Before the fight. Yeah, now we got our tank right here. Oh, wow, look at this. Look at this. Everybody's... Uh... Yeah, I'm really glad that newer IGs are making residents more of a thing. Well, these guys are not letting up. Oh, monster died. Right, These guys, wow, this is only wave one. My god. These guys do not want to die. Thank you, Gregor. Tengudo, I hear Nagorish. Choksasa, draw. Thank you, Sinclair. All right, God, I love, I love Gregor's new toys ID. And yeah, the robots were just freaking. Defense, like they, they were too big damage. <laughs> so close. All right. Oh, wow. Look at this. All right. We'll just win right in. Yeah, like, look at that. Wow. Five thirty is a test of game knowledge. Oh, wow. Oh, that was it. Wow. That was just that was like the shortest note ever. So no after story and just oh wow. 
That was the shortest note ever. Oh my god. Jeez. Alright. Lake and the Butterfly 4. Room was right. We couldn't even find a hint of the golden bow from the within the Lobotomy Corp branch. We'll have to search for the whale, like you said. Yep. Oh, 530 is a reading fight. Hello, Junko. Welcome to the stream. Oh, boy. Oh, and this is a pure combat note here. Oh, dang. Okay. Let's Uh, let's go red, red it all the way. Come on, here we go. Oh, it's a four wave. Oh no! I knew this was feeling a bit too easy. Oh god. Oh man, you fuck Barry. Oh no, we are gonna be so fucking dead. Four waves. Oh god. We have two out of four. Oh, God. When can we break out the ego? All right. Oh, no. Oh, good. Yes, resonance. Give me that sweet, sweet resonance. Yes! Okay. Yes, resonance. Yes, resonance. Yes, resonance. Yes, Oh wow, that really worked out well. Oh god, wave three and there's two big guys. He has just enough for one last quick suppression. Alright, there we go. And he's just done <laughs> for this fight. I, I just realized the the, the the way the four waves are their way of nerf of nerfing uh R E. They've gotta be. And you know what he's are he's falling off just in time for his chapter, which is next. He has the next chapter. <laughs> just in time for him to get another one. 
I don't know how they're gonna top our heat. Honestly. Because for most content, our heat is just too fucking good. Like for Mirror Dungeon, everything is one way. So, oh god, somebody got staggered. God damn it, Gregor. Uh, let's see if we can body sack. Yeah, we can. We can actually body sack. Raja, can you... Oh, she can't do her best one. Uh... Ah, oh, here we go. We're saved. Okay. God, I love that. Right, we gotta do this in three turns. Oh boy, okay, we have a good amount of resources. He, okay, Sinclair needs to charge up. Um, yes! Okay, we got Rhyme Shark in. Alright, let's do it. Yes! Exactly what I wanted. Alright, we're, we're good. We're good. We are so good. There we go. God damn it, that never does any fucking damage. We got our critical though, thanks to Gregor there. Alright. Rhyme Shark! God. I can't believe they tried to make us replace that. They would need something amazing to replace that one. Alright. Oh, oh wow, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I don't even need to choose anything. Look at this. Rip into shreds. I know that, Nekov. I just like to say it that way. Looks like Rim wasn't lying. I don't think there's a golden bow here. I don't feel the bow either. No. What will you do? All organic matter other than us in this lobotomy called branch has doubtless been infected. Is that a Rim guy? If he's got that mark. You think he's in cahoots with that flying blue kid from before? You know the one Sinclair has a crush on? Hey! Well, are we going to be okay? Actually, Well, he did help us at the end of the day. 
Even if he approached us very quietly. Hi. Oh. We can't do anything. MWCD. But what were we supposed to do? That's right. We can do anything. I guess. I guess so. There was nothing we could have done. But... Demian didn't have any... Still, I don't think Demian held any animosity against us. Not against you, maybe. I know, I s Sinclair defending him. <laughs> Hello, Devil on Tantra, welcome to the stream. Executive manager. I still remain doubtful of that man's intentions. He didn't even share with us what their goals were before fleeing the scene. Oi! You must know something about the bowl, Ed. You knew that bloke, didn't you? Rem has, ch Rem has changed too much. I cannot even begin to fathom his intentions. Let's get out of here first. It's pretty clear that the golden boat wasn't here anymore. <laughs> what fate befalls those who remain? Hello, Orion. Welcome to the stream. A fate we can do nothing about. Oh, da wow. It's, it's so cool seeing da a, a new side of Dawn here. I am well aware, but... I think I understand how you feel. Sometimes you just gotta learn to let go. <sighs> oh, there's a lot of If there's anything I've learned from my life, is that some things are too far gone to be helped. I guess so. Very well, Sir Heathcliff. When did it end? I'm sure I'm the only one who's ever been here. What's got in it? You Heath. Heath. Didn't know you had knew how to comfort someone like Zan. It's because his chapter's coming up next. <laughs> I wasn't gonna suffer that loss's gloom. Like every time it's like their chapter is the next one, they always get like a slightly bigger part than the one before. Which I, I think is I think that's pretty cool. And also the one after. With the pallid mermaids, unintelligible signals echoing behind us futilely, we decided to leave the lobotomy corp branch. We'll likely never understand them. Oh, We can't do anything about them. <laughs> oh, that's right. Since the uh, since the full update is gone, I can actually get the uh, extra, the EX clear stuff. All right, there we go. Harpoons. All right, one before the uh, Judgment Day stage. Uh, looks like I'm gonna have to pop a box. Uh, let's see. We were waiting by the entrance when a sudden shock to the Lobotomy Corp branch. Hurried out and gazed into the mists. Some intimidating looking vessel emerged. Up, oh, we gotta deal with the pirates, of course. They're d they're not done. No golden bow, no survivors. Yeah, we gotta deal with the pirates before we confront Ahab and the whale. Oh, tongue. 
ATFN. Honey, 새로운 시선의 작품을 볼수 있는 기회였으니 나쁘진 않았군. <웃음> no, it was a good chance to observe art crafted from a different perspective. I suppose all that wasn't for nothing. <웃음> 뭐 괜찮지 않겠어? 보통 이렇게 털리는 경우는 다음부터 대박 날 징조더라고. Then, we're going to be a okay. A big win always follows a big loss like this. Uh, 아무래도 그 가지를 찾으려면은 보수 한도 폰을 해줘 버려야 할것 같은데. 수영을 배웠어야 했나? We're going to have to scour the middle of the Great Lake to find that bow. Uh, maybe I should have learned how to swim. 그자의 말대로라면 방금 가지는. 창백한 고래가 삼키고 갔다는 거예요. If we're to believe Rim, that golden bow is inside the pallid whale. 정말 가는 것이요? 그 풍차만한 아니, 십차만한 아니, 성차만한? Are we truly journeying in search of the pallid whale? 창백한 고래를 찾으러 말이오? A whale as big as a windmill? I mean, as large as a mansion? No, nay, as grand as a castillo. Ooh, windmill. That's right. We're gonna have to. In Don's chapter, we're gonna have to fight a windmill abnormality. <laughs> yeah. Can we even catch something like that? Yeah, I think this is the first time we've we've actually heard the windmills. Yep. Yeah. Hello, Gal. Welcome to the stream. 그리고 잡는다고 해도 황금 가지는 어떻게 얻어? 다시 뱉으라고요? Hello, TO3. Uh, welcome to the stream. Oh, and thank you. <laughs> everybody's making everybody's making the same joke about this place. Freaking no note November branch of Lobotomy Corp. God damn it. Oh god. Even if we catch up to it, what then? Ask it nicely to please puke the bow out and in, back into our palms? Dragon and Guys, uh, maybe we should just go back and take the L here. Dragon Dagoo? Go back? Ah, Kuge. Oh, I mean. 돌아가면 그 다음은 어떻게 하실 건가요? 아, 뭐 황금 가지를 포기한다. And then what? What are you gonna do after we go back? What? Give up the golden bow? She's just like that? 그렇게 아무렇지 않게 없던 일로 하고 그 다음 작전으로 넘어간다. Pretend like nothing happened and just move on to our next mission. 황금 가지를 이런 식으로 포기하는 게이 집단에서 용인되었는지도 모르겠지만 I don't know how or when it's become acceptable in this group to throw away a golden bow just like that but 그게 어찌 되었든 저는 돌아가지 않아요 여기까지 내가 어떤 마음으로 버텨왔는데 Not me I'm not going back I've been doing too much to go back now 이 망할 회사에 들어오고 줄곧 버티고 있던 이유는 항상 하나뿐이었어요. There was just one thing that kept me going in the shitty company. One thing. Faust. 당신은 알죠? And you know what that is, Faust? 이스마일 씨의 말씀대로 이 정도의 상황에서 황금까지 수복을 포기하는 건 허용되지 않습니다. It is as Ishmael said. Abandoning the golden bow retrieval in the present situation is not permitted. Success is still within reach. 하지만 지금 당장은 어디론가 이동하지는 못할 겁니다. But we cannot move at this moment. 베르길리우스 씨와 합류해서 추후에 대한 논의를 하는 편이 적합할 것 같네요. It would be best that we rendezvous with Virgilius. Before discussing our next course of action. 
그건가? 이번에도 그 거지 같은 호수의 규칙 때문이지? <웃음> I see. It's that stupid law of the Great Lake again, eh? 네, 그렇습니다. 약 2시간이 남았군요. Yes, it is. We have two hours remaining. 참 잘했어요, 히스클리프 씨. Wow, good work, Ke- good work, Heathcliff. You're so smart. You don't. You little. Whoa! Sudden shock shook everyone. Let's get out of here first. What madness is this? Oh, now we're in one piece. I have observed multiple ships on the horizon, beyond the wall of mist. None of their silhouettes resemble Mephistopheles. What the? Misfire, maybe? Why? Look around! The water level! It'll be up to our bridges any minute! Oh shit! Oh shit! What the hell? It was as Heathcliff said. When we first got to this branch, the water level was down there. And now it had risen high enough that the waves were lapping at the platform we were standing on. It's high time. It appears that this lake's water levels rise and fall depending on the time of day. They have launched something in our direction. Brace for impact! Here comes another! So, not a misfire then. Numerous harpoons suddenly riddled the ground we were on. We were being bombarded with harpoon shots. Flung with nary a care whether it hit someone or not. <laughs> Ryoshu carried a few harpoons away with the back of her sword, but there were simply too many. Okay. It's those twin hook pirates again, huh? Got to say, I can respect their tenacity. Those trash in here only thanks to your very stubborn mercy, Dante. Ryoshu could probably parry a nuke if she wanted to. <laughs> say not such things. What manager Esquire did that day was a judgment most noble. She was not an easy decision, forsooth. I don't I am not used to quiet John. <laughs> Jeez. It's so weird not to hear her screaming her head off. What? Just use your nogans for once. They're bound to that likes just as we are this one. Harpoonists all they want. It's not like them swords can drag their ship toward us. So in the meanwhile, what's it? No. That's not what the pirates use harpoons for. That's how. Ha <laughs> ha! Now you know why they call us the twin hooks. Oh boy. Yo, they created a fucking zip line.
Are you ready, kids? Ooh, who wants to ride on the harpo <laughs> Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Pirate time again. Oh, boy. Oh my god. Hambatang Hebulka. Thank you, Sinclair. <laughs> Hello, Hammer. Welcome to the Alright. And it's three waves, a normal three wave fight. Yes, resonance time. Hambatang Hebulka? Yes, I oh, just got some dagger. Oh, I hate it when that happens. Gun I love that is Aldis's best ID. Absolutely. Who got fucking staggered? Sinclair. I am disappointed, Sinclair. Let's see. Anybody? No. Yeah, no rhyme shark. Hambatang Hebulka? God, that's such a good attack. My god! I can't believe this was a free ID. I can't believe that was a free with login ID for Outer. And final wave. Alright, Sinclair, you need, uh, you need to recharge. Nope. Damn it. Roger, oh, Roger can do her thing. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 
They're called welfares. Ah, uh, clutter. Oh, Sinclair's gonna distort. Yeah, yep, he's distorted. Alright. It's my fault. It's okay, Sinclair. You just get it all out of your system. Still gonna win the battle. That's fine. Sick job, I get Hamira. Mandingoya. One book and Hamba. Sean and Mandingoya. It's just impending day. Roger can take it, especially with that ID. 45 HP is nothing to her, it's nothing to DHC Roger. Okay. 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 The Elcor facility. Oh boy, here we go. All right, we're gonna have to eat a uh, a box. That's okay. Ex requirement. Ex wait. Ex objective is wait. What is the ex objective? Where does it say? It's not telling me. Just win? The EX objective is literally just win. Oh my god. Oh shit. Okay, uh, it's gonna be a, like a fucking uh, Dongbaek type uh, suit. Dongbaek type uh, mini boss here. That's mini. Oh, oh. Oh wow, okay, so we have to use her. Okay. Let's see. Uh, uh. Huh. I forgot your blunt. Uh. Yeah, let's put uh, Yu Song in here. Um. We need Pierce. Oh, you you was Bash? Oh, I thought we wanted Pierce. Okay. Oh, we okay. I was gonna make a okay. All right, we'll use Team Blunt. Here we go, Team Blunt. Let's go. All right, and. Uh, Lou, yep, all right, let's switch her over to Lou. All right, let's go. Oh, wait, you know what? Who's Team Blunt? I forgot. The King of Blunt right here. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, I. Getting rego. I don't know. Should I. Get rid of freaking Heath or Heath or, or Aldis. Oh damn! What a decision. Uh, get rid of Heath or Aldis for you, Song. You've been waiting for me to get it. Hello, constantly welcome to the stream. Oh yeah, oh yeah. If Heath, Heath is gonna run out, so we'll, we'll, we'll bring him. Yeah, uh, we'll get rid of him. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All right, 
let's go. Lucea. Yeah, Heath is Pierce. And, uh, but Yu Song is blunt, so. Yeah, okay. All right, we got Team Blunts here. Let's go. Look at all blunt all day, every day here. Blunt. Blunt. Fuck out. All right, let's go. All right. Oh boy, a big fight here. We're fighting them off somehow, but. Let's ship in the middle sure is eye catching. That's true, letter, clutter. <laughs> Rabbit Heath be being Pierce is countered by Rabbit Heath being Rabbit Heath. Literally just the man who just deletes the first enemy he fights. <laughs> Things are usually that gaudy for a reason, you know? Uh, oh, uh, oh. oh. 저기, 저 가운데 있는 사람 말이야. That guy standing there at the center. Why would you rarely ever show this much fear and anxiety? Yes, seriously. That weird guy up there? He's been posing like that over there ever since this whole mess started. Pum? 그런 게 아니야, 단테. Posing? That's not what I'm talking about, Dante. Oh, hello, Gal. Welcome to stream. I don't know if I welcomed you before. Uh, don't you recognize his tattoos? He's. Huh. A BB of the middle. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Yep, I can see you. I can see you in uh, Twitch. Welcome, Millie, to the stream. Oh my god. What's a bitch, brother? Sinclair, now I'm, I'm concerned if you've been translating all of Ryoshu's other stuff correctly before. <laughs> <laughs> Now I'm concerned if he's translated all her other acronyms before correctly. I uh, think she meant the big brother. <laughs> oh. Yeah, Sinclair can only say fuck if it's about Cromer. <laughs> bringing up this up now but what's uh, the middle <laughs> oh Dante sitting in your mansion or me side of them alone seems to shock and intimidate a lot of people remember they pretty much traumatized pilot well thank you for the reminder gal that it was in the middle of that slaughtered Rogers neighborhood I heard that the fingers, which the middle is part of, Yeah, they're basically wings, except non-sanctioned. They're, they're criminal organizations, each one as big as a wing. We've never, uh, we've never he even heard of what the pinky does at all. Like they're, they're the very mysterious one. Are on a completely different level from your average syndicates. I've never met any of them face to face before, but we th we fought the thumb and the index in Ruina. Honey, 직접 만나는 것부터가 있어서는 안 되는 일이야. 
No. People like us, we are never supposed to meet them like this. A real acronym! Oh my god. We're all gonna be FUBAR. Well, you've died before, Ryoshu, but... Time for my one last sig. It is a good day to die, isn't it? Ryoshu... Even you? Dante. Oh wow, gal, so oh the pinky is like the Hana of the of the of the fingers. Interesting. <laughs> if a trial must be weathered, we will weather it with dignity and tenacity, Dante. I had my character development, I have my goddamn wings. I can do anything. <laughs> Oh boy. All right. All right. How was the warm? Big bro is giving you all your time for a warm up. Appreciate it. Oh boy. Wearing sunglasses in this gloomy weather? All hands prepare for battle. Well, they are hyping him up. Executive manager, this battle, this foe, will not be like any other we have encountered before. Under such dire circumstances, ensuring the safety of the commanding officer has to be our primary objective. You really need to read. Please, find a safe place to hide. Make sure to stay out of his sight. Whoa, what is that he has clipped onto him? Oh, it's a book. Oh god, what voice should I give him? He's like Don Flamingo, you're right. Boring. Didn't think you would take this long for a warm. Let us negotiate. If you're seeking to negotiate, we're more than ready to listen. Negotiate with a villain such as he? How? Well, looks like we're the ones begging for our lives now. More energetic? Okay, thanks. I think that not. More rough? Okay, and energetic? Okay. I... Uh, I didn't think that the big brother of the middle would be here in person. Yeah, but I am. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So... In all those years I spent as part of the middle. Tanhana. Get it is some n churchigi sata. I had this one iron rule that I never broke. Is this better? Okay. Hajiman no nobro, get churchigi san san jogang nagum marabura. Until today, that is. Your raid of my personal safe has forced my hand! What? He looks like. He looks a bit like Kiryu. <laughs> what damn? Unbelievable! 
All of my mind thinks they're doing something so heinous. Sangalgori pari taroso ga ani go? Wait. What? Maybe it's about what happened back at the Twin Hooks Club. A bulky ancient book hung from his waist, secured in place by thick chains. He lifted it with his hand. Kurani, Ijari is so cool. So here on this day, I declare your sins, O oh guilty ones. Your unforgivable sins. Uh, look, have we had a little kerfuffle with Miss Me, but today, Buanin, we are going to be able to Your subordinate, she. Remain safe and unharmed. Wait, no, stop! Sumi? Oh, fucking hell! Oh, Ishmael was right! Sumi. Who's that? Oh, whoa. No way, he didn't know? <laughs> My interjection may have been unnecessary. Ah, let's go. Then, well then, uh, okay, let's see. With that sin piled on top. The big brother began flipping through the pages, taking time to wet his fingers. Angapum Tang Buddha. Togia Tokajin Yidamdirim, more good city. Who saw so probably come and <laughs> That's the Book of Vengeance. Once your name's written on that book, Fubar is also written into your fate. <laughs> hilarious. So hilarious that I might go mad. Hahaha. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, here we go. Luscious and bristly. Jeez. Ah, the two genders. Luscious and bristly. Listen. We live in a binary world. The world that is luscious and the world that is bristly. Are you aware of their differences? Silence. The urge to blurt out, what the hell are you talking about, was palpable, yet it was suppressed by an unknown, incredibly patient force. The luscious is what flows and wraps gently around your hand when your fingers comb through it. And the bristly is what roughly stabs and pokes out between your fingers. Patience. Perseverance. And a delicate pair of talented hands are crucial to becoming the most luscious that one can be. I 
again. I bet he has a tax called Luscious and Bristly. Do you understand? Do you understand now the incredible amount of effort that goes into maintaining this hair in the right shape and the perfect lusciousness? <laughs> oh my god, this guy is off the deep end. There once was a coupon. A coupon to get the coveted personal hands on hair care. Can I even meong shil won jang ege? Hair styling and muriat has a shikan to one paddle swin and coupon. Oh, my God. From the director of a top of a luxury hair salon and one of the richest ports of U Corp. The Stingray port ship contiguously for five hours! Hello, Raphael, you're here as I lose my voice. <laughs> it is said that with that coupon, anyone could enter the world of the luscious. And anyone with a coupon had the privilege of an appointment free visit. Oh. So we're being accused of taking his coupons for a hair salon. So when you called him a bitch, brother. <laughs> Wow, he was actually he was actually correct in that translation. I meant that he can be a real bitch to get rid of once you piss him off. Damn it. We should have steered clear of these bastards. They would have been my first steps into the world of the luscious. Yet, the coupon thief. I wonder who actually stole the coupon. <laughs> We don't have your goddamn coupon. Has left me stranded indefinitely in the world of the bristly. Behold. Behold the testament to your heinous sins! God damn it, Heath! <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, man? Are these like gold bars you're stealing? Oh, these and jewelry? Oh my god. Heath! Oh, and this is gonna lead. Is it, are these gifts for your fucking girlfriend that we're gonna meet in 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 the next chapter? <laughs> oh my god! The big brother tossed a piece of paper before us. On it was a picture. God damn you, Heath! Heath left. 몰랐어, 전 거신 줄은. 아야, 그렇잖아. 금고에 알록달록한 고양이 스티커들만 붙어 있었다고. 그걸 뭐 누가 저런 엄청난 녀석 금고일 거라고 생각해? Uh, I didn't know the safe was his. Look, it's got quite a few kitty stickers on it. Gotta be absolutely bombed in sooner state of a middle big brother, right? 
Everyone has different tastes. Just like the numerous colorful lakes of the Great Lake. <laughs> you have a blatant lack of respect for the first differing tastes. Will have to be added to the Book of Vengeance as well. Someone please shut Heath up before he adds anything more to that book! Oh. Heathcliff, did you even know who, what, or where these coupons were for? Can you give them back? Goose not bloody hell. a gift for his fucking girlfriend. Oh, I've got my reasons. There is one good news, however. The chance of your absolution? Even if you were to return the coupons, is infinitesimal. Infinitely close to nil, in fact. Yeah, not zero? Ro Ro, fight the power? Thus, keeping the coupons will make no difference to the outcome of this encounter, Heathcliff. They are now yours. The bad news? Is that will all be oofed before he Heathcliff even gets the chance to use them? I wonder if this is what like the Christmas uh, interlude is gonna be about. Heath going to the fucking hair salon. <laughs> oh my god. With his extended passion speech coming to an end. Wow, like, yeah, this is like freaking uh, Sinclair to Ryoshu communication here. They, they click for some reason. Which is weird because they seem to be polar opposites. <laughs> the big brother of the middle and Don Quixote both wipe the tears from their eyes. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> And the price to your sins. Uh, let's see. Title 8, Section 20 says. <laughs> On row 8, line 6. Uh, hair salon coupons. That book has instructions in case someone steals their hair salon coupons! Kira. Ah, I found it. Complete and total extermination of all involved parties. Execute the coupon thief 
and any of all of their affiliates. Effective immediately. Yokshi. <laughs> so chop. Truly a BB. Nan Chungje Chagan Yang Yim Likaradota. Chugumyan Sasegitoro. Kiagan Muchagina Chungyani. My name's Ricardo. A big brother of the middle. Let my name be the last thing you remember before you perish. Memories are important. After all. Yeah, Heathcliff is from District T. That's where we're going next. Ryoshi threw her one last sig to the ground, smoke down to the butt. Unsatisfying. I'll get a proper luxury sig next time. If there is a next time. And the big brother quite literally soared into the air. Oh boy, that was some intro. Oh my god! Premium, oh my god. He has an intro just like the fucking, uh, clock did. Oh boy. Alright, let's read. What the fuck is this status? Paralyzed. Fix the power of points zero for one turn. One click. Why? Wow. And we're not even up to the boss yet. Every time middle ally is killed, gain one offense. Oh god. So you want them to die together. Oh, it's just paralyzing. Upon clash, lose, gain one minus coin boost next turn. Oh, okay, so it's a hit. Oh, oh, it's a focus. Okay. Nah, we ball, we ball, we ball, we ball. It's time. Let's build up burn. Okay. Head to get to Puggy. Right, we can take as many turns as we, as we want. <laughs> yep, they're definitely the one. Are we won all our clashes? Neutral. Oh boy. Oh no, we've neutralized. Oh shit, fucker. Get to Huggin. Failed it to take. 
Yes, okay, we got a stagger. Thank you, Roja. Alright, we got them staggering this time. And one down. All right, okay, here we go. All right, look at that, look at that, they're all staggered. Oh, don't do this. Don't do that. That's not very nice. Stupid thing -o. Just die. There we go. Alright, oh, right, so he's in the, the boss is in the third wave. Okay. So far, so good. Pretty manageable. Oh, no joy. You're gonna really neutralize me? Okay. It's weird that the atta her attack is called Slice, yet it is a. Uh, It, it is a blunt move. How to get to hugging? I really like that there's no turn limit. So far, this fight is very manageable. We haven't even lost a single class yet, although I'm gonna jinx it with that. Seven Ryoshi skills slash is also blunt. I thought Ryoshi. Uh, oh no, no, I was, I was thinking of. Um, W which is pure slash. Right, well, that's fine. Oh no! Oh no! That's not. That's not Sinclair. That's Ishmael. Uh, uh, how about you attack the staggered one? All right. The Ashi Rojo knows all about shields. Ah, uh, there we go. We got the AOE. <laughs> I don't go on his fucking That guy's almost dead. All right, now the hard part. Okay, boss. Question mark HP, eh? Punching, kicking, payback. Oh boy. It's like three paralyzed next turn. 
We don't know jack shit. Offense level plus five. Okay, we don't know, uh... Let's get egotistical here. Okay. Quick, get so good. Alright, let's make this, oh boy, make this matter memorable. Game 2, Test of the Big Brother. Wrath Fragility. Test of Turn and reduce it. Take double damage from skills. Double the amount of st staggered threshold raised from Tremor Burst. A flight tries when, when expires when the scene is staggered. Just get down to st stagger threshold two. Check the passage. Uh. I, I can't find the status effect. Just this offense level up. Sorry. Next time, one. Leave. I can't even see his status at all. Deal plus 20% damage with blood. Oh, it's not yet on him. Okay, okay. Uh, we got an ego. I already did read it.
Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, we're getting his HP down. Resources. No, we don't have any ego. Oh, thank God. He saw my man coming in. What? How do you not class? Target the counter? Oh boy. I don't know, but targeting one side leaves you open to be attacked. It just seems counterintuitive. And counterproductive. I know, it seems like I'm being trolled. <laughs> We got we got rid of the fuck Oh yeah <laughs> Time to fucking rinse Alright let's go You song my man Oh my god anyone have anyone have ego can anyone ego Ishmael can How apropos Ha! <laughs> Alright. Oh, he's gathering for a big boost. Summon two allies next turn, eh? Alright, let's see. Charging up his laser.
Look at all this burn and sinking and tremor and status he has. That doesn't matter shit. Oh wow, he is really attacking, um... <laughs> oh wow, he is really, um... Against Roja. Anyone have any, uh... Doesn't even matter this time. Alright, uh, Roger, I think you better just defend. I think we got his two next stagger. Oh, he didn't. I thought he was going to be staggered. Oh, my hair, Koopas. Oh, he's going to fucking kill us all. If the main target is less than zero SP, final power plus five. He's going to fucking kill us all over hair, coupon. Yeah, let's not even try to clash with a mass attack. Alright, everybody just, just fuck these other guys. Uh, can anyone do an ego? Oh my god. Should I do Sinclair's ego? the main target. I can't even see who the main target is. God damn it, the stupid words are in the way. Is it Yi Song? It's probably Yi Song. I jeez. Oh no, it's Roja. Of course it's Roja. Where is Roja? Here we go. Roja? Uh defend. <laughs> okay. You gotta take another one for the team, Roja. I'm sorry. Pouch? Yeah, you can't do it. Okay. Your weakness is written right here! Scarlet Silver Iron, welcome to the stream. He's staggered! Oh wow, look at this animation here. Oh! Oh wow, what a perfect ID to use. What a perfect ID to use. Oh my god, what? Oh! Bleed and total extermination. Defeat. Wait. Oh God. Did we actually uh, lose? Oh no, we didn't. Oh, oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow.
We got the bad ending? Oh. Wait, we did? Oh, wait. I didn't even know they could have a bad ending. Oh, man. Oh, it's a fourth loss? Okay, good. God damn it, you guys. So wait, did we actually win or no? Wait. I'm confused. Let's just keep going. Hello, that me out. Welcome to the stream. You regenerate like nothing happened. Ne, sonjil bara soya hala on the nare marina. Tashin kiraji motar tende. It's a scripted loss. Okay, good. Hey, we did it. We did it, you guys. One try. <laughs> First fucking try. Unlike my hair gel, we should have received its rightful care that day, and will never recover. Hello, Malvin, or hello, Nats. Welcome to the stream. Can my clock even make a difference against someone so overwhelmingly powerful? My legs began to shake. Strategy, resurrections, it all seemed completely meaningless against this onslaught. Dun -te. Dun -te. Val's voice calling my name has never sounded more hollow. Speak, Faust. Are we going to unlock a new power or something? What the hell? You must come up with a new plan. My bodily functions We'll cease again in a matter of moments. This may be my last meaningful advice to you. And sooner or later, that man from the middle will come for you. What? The involvement of an individual affiliated with the middle should not have happened. does not matter how many times you turn the clock. That man will crush your clock as soon as he tires of inventing different ways of killing Heathcliff. <coughs> oh. oh, shit. Oh, shit. We got a new power. There is a button on the back of your head. Tap it times. Hold it times. How many times? I had grown accustomed to total annihilation. We've had plenty on our journey here. Sinners always gave their lives to learn our enemies' weaknesses or patterns while I worked out a strategy from the year, rear. And the answer would always be somewhere within our reach. Slowly but surely, we'd figure out the answer. And for that promise of an answer, the sinners rose again. That... This time was... <laughs> It's a self-destruct. It's a self-destruct. But then what's the difference between that and him crushing the head? 
Once you have completed the sequence, you have 30 seconds before the charge in your head explodes. In other words, you can self-detonate. That is our last resort. An emergency preventative measure to stop our enemies from getting their hands on the golden bows. While the explosion radius may be small, the heat and the force it generates are powerful enough to melt even the stars of the city. See, this guy is clearly on the level of a star of the city, for sure. It should be effective enough to cremate the golden bows as well. What about Virgilius? He said he'd come help before my head. I see that you now have the full understanding of our predicament. We have no way of relaying our present situation to him. Even if he did learn of our troubles, he has no means of, to reach us within the next two hours. Yeah, Index Proxy and Thumb Kappa were still pretty high up. What about the sinners? When I'm gone, you guys are... Oh my god, everybody is going to be absolutely... Everybody is going to be absolutely shitting on Heathcliff after this. My god. Heathcliff is going to get so much shit from everybody. I'm well aware of the consequences. My world will meet its end here. That is why this is your last resort. I could keep running away. I'll take the boat to try to stay alive into the laws of the lake. Let Virgilius cross the borders and... There is a chance, yes, but it is incredibly slim. This was the second time after Siegfried. The overwhelming sense of dread. So overwhelming that it breaks even our fighting spirits. You know, All Might, you know, I remember him. The incident with Siegfried was humiliating, but he wasn't there to obliterate us. He was just there to teach us a lesson. And this man, he's not going to stop until he's completely broken every sinner's will. Until he's satisfied. Until the humiliation in the middle of the place is recuperated. He will kill. Company. 
even though this may be the end of LCB, the world, no, Limbus Company must continue to exist. Dante, you must make a judgment call. <laughs> Look what we have here. I've torn you to pieces. Yet with burning eyes, you still attempt to rise. <laughs> we can't. Not here. Not like this. <laughs> <laughs> Tick tock and bring back the dead, huh? Seasan Cham Joajone. Can the Charangis read to she so to turn in Vienna? To Ram and Kunani make a Murobai get good. Is the great sister the leader? What a world we live in. Is that kind of tech even allowed in the city, though? I guess I'll go ask the great sister once I get back. Ishmael, we... can't win. I'm sure Ishmael knew that better than anyone. I couldn't bring myself to tell her the same thing. Shut up! <laughs> Stop fucking around and do your job! Thank you, eh? Yes, so. Give it another try, why don't you? Say <laughs> Bring me back! Again! Ishmael and I were nothing more than entertainment to him. With every turn of the clock, with every revival, he howled with laughter and clapped with joy. Oh my god. Victory. All right, this is a purely story note. Uh, well, do you think this one will be a good place to stop? <laughs> oh, we're leaving the building with this one. It'll be a good place to stop after this one? Okay, good. Oh boy. This is nothing short of a massacre. A humiliation. He kills Ishmael again and again. I keep bringing her back, feeling that same pain that killed her. The battle is lost. Maybe Faust is right. Maybe this is where our journey ends. You think 33 is a good place? Uh, I'll do 531 and then stop. Yeah, I, that's what I'm going to do. And then next time, we're going ri to stop right before the dungeon. Wait, I thought 36 was the end. Oh my god. You know what's hilarious? In one of the very early events of Arknights, there was a character called the Rat King that looked exactly like him, except had a rat head, like with the same type of coat and everything, and was like a ridiculously strong opponent that they couldn't face. And what they did with the Rat King was that they were actually able to knock off the Rat King's coat. And that basically showed them how, showed him how strong they were. And uh, that was the end of the fight. Now, granted, he and the Rat King are two very different characters, but I don't know. It, 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 I'm getting that vibe. That, that, that event had one of the best endings, didn't it, Doris? Yeah.
Good, good. You nicked my sunglasses. Hajiman, Tom Kiwi. Too bad. You'll have to try again. Yeah, like he was a, a like a, a level far beyond, and like that we were currently at, and it's like a level that we're currently at now in Ark Knights. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it! I, did, I didn't face all those waves just to... As long as I can keep trying, I can... The mist thickens. It expands, devouring everything. Our futures, our hopes, and any slim chance of victory we had. And so does the fog of my sight, of my mind. Will this continue until either Ishmael gives up, or until he gets tired of this little game? Until he simply walks over and crushes my clock? For Jeely's piece, my shattered clock back. Is that even possible? If I did as Faust told me and blew up my head, not even a shred of me would. Huh. <sighs> You repertoire is starting to get old. Main event. Oh, shit. How about we just zoom right past that? Then to the main event. I call this clock passion. Dante! Dante! Run! Run! No! Dante, run! Get out of here! I don't know how to get out of here. I don't know how to get out of here. <laughs> that clock fella's got to be someone very precious to you. Mm -hmm. Just look at it. Hanging onto my leg. After all that beating. <laughs> Not the manager! No! Not Dante! Not Dante! Should I press the button? Is that really gonna be my last ever thought? There was a distant sound, like an answer to my question. That solemn sound toiled told clearly through the blinding fog. Uh. Oh, we got saved. It was a skin. <gasps> Who is this? Is this Virgilius? One much smaller, more modest than ours. From beyond the misty veil, the skiff slowly glided across the water in our direction. On it was a solitary figure holding an oar. A giant harpoon was attached to the boat bow of the ship. Oh, this might be Ahab. What? Oh, that is the worst person to save us. But why? Big brother of the middle. Who could probably break that puny skiff in half with his bare hands. Stares at it in stunned silence. It became clear that the skiff didn't float here by accident. Who is this? The figure on the boat began gently rowing in our direction. Through the mist, 
We saw something. Flash atop the sea. Bigger hurled something our general direction. It flew so fast that no human eye could catch it. I didn't even have the time to register that something was thrown. For an Oh my god! For I noticed that something was piercing the big brother's left shoulder. Then a Oh my god! One blow! A powerful shockwave, far mightier than anything the pirates had fired earlier, struck us. The air itself quaked. It was not a distance that most people would even think about jumping across, but... Oh, this has got to be Ahab. It's got to be her. Oh my god, look at that. This is like Ishmael's ego weapon here. The figure leapt over from the skiff to Lobotomy Corp ranch gracefully and with agility. Truly an anime moment, Clutter. Absolutely. The man from the middle, who so far had appeared unassailable, stumbled and fell to his knees. His shoulder was cured. Oh, Ahab is totally going to survive. Ahab is totally going to survive and join the new blue man group. Oh, my God. Oh. <sighs> Zhang Xin. <sighs> You. That's when I finally noticed that what the figure had thrown was a harpoon. Yep. A harpoon too immense to be thrown by a mere person. Yet alone at such a blinding speed. The hooded figure's arm was wreathed in a familiar light. <laughs> Young gun uh, You old geese. <laughs> She's a caller now! Or is it a different person? Thought you were out there, fishing. What? You think you're some hot shit now? They made you a caller? Just cause you hunted the Marlin whale? Are you challenging the middle to a hunt like with some whale? Is that it? Nare Kongyo Kandarin de Atentis in Jinan. Alman and Saramil Tenda Maria. You're not the kind of idiot that would attack me without knowing the consequences. Oh, no, it's not Ahab. Hajpan, Yogiungus and Kutemunia. Oh, it's not Ahab. I'm guessing this is like a, the new blue, right? It would be the new blue. Oh God, I, can't, I don't think I can do a voice that deep. The deepest I can do is Roland. And, and, and like the one I just did right there. For this guy. Ah, uh, shit. Uh, fuck. Damn it. <laughs> the middle is no different from a whale. Hm. But that's not why I am here. <laughs> I'm just after a fish that got away. <laughs> That's the best I can do. Hawkma <laughs> voice? Okay, I, uh, it, either that or Hawkma, you guys can vote. Of course you are. I'm sure there's no need for me to remind you that the middle never forgets. Oh, this is, a, this is sure a throat killing episode. Oh, God. <laughs> if 
feel free to write me down the remaining margins of that nasty little book, if you wish. The old man tongues the harpoon lodged in the big brother's shoulder. <clears throat> the big brother tried to hold his ground against the harpoon's pull until there was a crunch. Those that do not bend, break. The harpoon tore off his entire shoulder with it. It was a force that would have turned most people into tattered meat. Not bad. Would you like to give it another try? Fine, fine! I'll leave for now. But don't you forget! The middle remembers. It doesn't matter what I did here. The middle will remember everyone and everything that dared to turn their back on it. Out. 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 And the middle always pays bits its debts in whichever form. Ishmael and I had no choice but to watch in silent awe as the old man approached us. The harpoon was still in his hand, and if he were to strike us with it, we could never hope to get out of its way. Are you going to help us kill the white whale? I, you, we really, I think we wouldn't stand a chance without you. Oh boy. I'm looking for the fish that consume this structure. Are you two also here to fish? So he seems like a a fixer, a color fixer in charge of hunting whales. Oh boy, well, okay, that's an awesome cliffhanger to leave things on. It is late. Oh boy. And another story. Indigo Elder, that's what he's called. Okay, great. <laughs> the Indigo Elder. All right, you guys. Well, that was amazing. Next time we will be finishing. Oh, wow, look at this. Look at this. Uh, look at this barrier here. I can tell where we're going here. Oh, my God. Epic as hell. Um, we will continue on Sunday at the same time. You're right, probably related to Hemingway's Old Man in the Sea. Yeah, we'll be continuing next time. We'll get right up to before the dungeon next time. All right, so until then, I will say so long, farewell, Alvarita Zane, good night. You're all the sweetest of hearts. See ya. <laughs>